everyone. I'm Meredith McNeil, Director of Art Yard Brooklyn. This week, we kicked off our collaboration, Art Yard, Art Matters, with PS282 in Brooklyn. Our programs take place on Zoom every Wednesday and are open to all 282 students, pre-K through fifth graders, on a first-come, first-served basis. This Wednesday, I was the teaching artist. I spy with my eye art-making sessions inspired by Andrew Ginzel and Kristen Jones, MTA, Arts for Transit Mosaic Installation, Oculus, which is at the Chamber Street subway station. Through a screen-shared PowerPoint, we viewed several photos of the Oculus installation, a diagram of the eye and its parts, a beautiful eye mural I photographed on the street in Rome, and several samples of eye paintings by children and adults. Students used a small mirror for reference as they carefully depicted a larger-than-life portrait of their own eye from observation using watercolor. Our second project was a drawing game, I Spy, in which I carefully described an item while the students listened. I repeated the description, adding details as the students drew from my description. I held up the mysterious objects a small stone sculpture of a face representing the wind, and a tomato-shaped pincushion. We shared the finished pieces by holding up our paintings to the screen. For our critique, students complimented each other's work. Lucas enthused, Chloe's work looks fantastic. Tristan exclaimed, I love the design of Luke's eye because it looks identical to his real eye. And Kyler complimented, I love Kiara's eye, and she really made great choice of colors. Looking at these excellent student paintings, I must agree with Oculus artists Andrew Ginzel and Kristen Jones in their assessment. Eyes are both subtle and strong. They engage passing individuals, allowing for meditation or inviting dialogue.